Hey guys, I just woke up technically, I was going to say I just woke up when I didn't. I just recorded yesterday's video, um, on the day that it's out, and uh, yeah, I woke up an hour and a half ago. It seems like I've woken up now because I went, I basically got back into bed, but I've been up, I've been on my phone, searched a few things up, mum, saw my mum, she had to go out. And then I made a nice cup of tea for me, a cup of coffee for her, a cup of coffee for my dad. Then I come up here and started listening to a bit of When You're Gone by Bulla Bean. Um, and today we're not going to see my sister. Well, depends. Well, if it's around the same time, oh, two hours, then yeah, I'm going to come back here. I'm just going to watch a bunch of Raw. Maybe some videos. See how we're doing. Because as you guys know, every Wednesday, I said that I'll basically be staying at my sister's for three days. Well, for the next two, two and a half days. Um, and then obviously come back on the Friday morning. Today's going to be a bit different. Today, me, Phoebe and Chloe might be seeing another movie. Which is Gemini Man. Um, because obviously each week we used to go go to the movies and see something new come out. Obviously, Chloe, uh, Chloe and Phoebe, they've been really busy with school, so they can't, they haven't basically had enough time to do it. And plus, for some reason, I just haven't wanted to go out on Tuesdays to see a movie. Um, plus, whenever I've asked, mainly people are busy. And in the Wednesday, obviously, I go straight to my sister's. Normally, like, I'd be getting ready now and going to my sister's, but I'm not going to do that. I don't think she knows that. But I'm not staying at hers tonight. I might stay at hers tomorrow. I can walk to hers in the morning. And then literally for the whole day. All right, technically, I can meet her in the morning. Actually, I'm going to give her a ring after this. I'm going to give her a ring. And I'm going to talk to her about tomorrow. On the day that you see this one, technically. I'm going to try and say, okay, so how about I meet you in the morning in Woolwich. She does all the shopping and that. And then we go back to hers. Then we just watch a bunch of stuff. And then the next day, she does the work and I come back home. Instead of me staying an extra night and doing the same thing we would have done on the first day, on the Wednesday, and then the Thursday, because we always go out, that could be a bit different. You know what I'm saying? It saves her time, it saves me time. I get to, you know, watch some stuff which I need to watch. Come to think about it, if Chloe and Karen get up, then I could technically stay, watch my Bill episodes with them, before they have to leave later. But we'll get into that in a bit. Well, change of plan. I'm in Tesco with a sister. And... I just had a big cat breakfast with the dad that he paid for it, so thank you, love you. Went into a few shops with Sam, and now I'm making sure she does her own packing in the blue. Because I don't want to help. Ooh, we've got two cops in the store. Now we're going to go back to hers, and we're going to watch some orange and new black because Mark's not at work for the next two days. Which means we can watch it fully for the next two days. And I feel fat. And I'm going to try and improve my posture by sitting up properly. No slanting. And I'm trying to only get sand to drink water and only buy good things that is healthy. She bought a Cornish pasty. Not good. She's pissed off though. Because <laughs> I told her she won't allow it. So she don't like it. <sighs> So yeah, I'll see you guys very late at night when Mark's asleep and I'll be able to do an outro then. Oh, well, <coughs> I feel tired. So, uh, yeah, I think the last clip was, was it after? We went to the calf. I don't even remember. But yeah. 
<sighs> My dad bought us cap and we were happy about it. Then me and Sam had to go to a few shops. Ooh. Don't you just love finding McDonald's vouchers everywhere you go so you can use them literally every time you go to McDonald's. It's only two pounds for a meal apart from the drink. But then again you can get two drinks for a pound in a fan shop. Even if it's water. Doesn't matter. <coughs> um Yeah. Now normally every single time I go to my sister's house, Wednesday to Friday, and we go out shopping. Okay, we get a little bit crazy. Because obviously my, my sister works, she has a lot more money than I do right now. She's always got money to get little bits like, you know, donuts or pasties or edge drinks or something like that. But we always go to the, we always go to the pharmacy in uh, Woolwich mainly because of the scales basically. And we always weigh ourselves. My sister, she's put a pound on since last week. And I've, I basically stayed the same. My weight's not changed. Um, so yeah, um, we didn't get any, we didn't get anything else today, we didn't get any food that we didn't need, we didn't get any drink that we didn't need, the only thing I've been drinking is water, the only thing I've eaten since we come back here, because obviously we were in Woolwich, we were looking around, we had to literally hurry up, yeah. When, when I was there, my dad had to go blab. He had to go to do this course thing that he's doing that lasts for two hours, two and a half hours sometimes. No. Yeah, two hours. So we told him, well, technically, as we were in the cap, I told him, I went, when you finish, don't go home. Come to Sam, because you've got to take Sam back to Mum's because I'm going to get them for you. And he was like, okay. They were, they were dog treats. Literally, the doggy milky bones from the pound shop that I always get dogs because they love them and you give them one or two a day or three and they bloody like it and it's good for them. My mum, she doesn't give a fuck. This is why when I move out, I'm taking the dog with me and she ain't gonna say nothing. If she clearly don't wanna flip it, take the dog for a walk or get it treats or actually give it two, pack, two packs in the morning as well as at night instead of one in the morning and one at night and a few biscuits during the day, Mum, you're not you're not flipping taking care of the dog, right? Clearly, I'm the one that has to do everything. Uh, but I'm I'm okay to do that. Even getting it dog treats. My mum, I, I even remember my mum when she gets paid dog treats. Oh, what was that? You didn't listen, so I have to now go out and get it myself, which I don't mind doing. But if you're going out shopping, you get the dog food, you get the dog biscuits. Why don't you just get the dog treats as well? It just makes sense. But yeah, he we come back here, put everything away, sat down, and what we'll be watching? Because we weren't watching anything on Netflix. We were sitting there just talking about random bits at first. Oh no, because Mark was watching something. Mark's asleep right now. It's his wife. I can look in the video. Um, so yeah, he was watching something. So we were like, okay, we'll sit there and chill, be on our phones for about 20 minutes half an hour that's what we were doing we watched prince fresh prince of bel-air so obviously that's on netflix we're watching it from the start that's another thing we're watching from the start to the end although luckily that's just for me that's not for sam and me where i have to come here each week and then we watch it together no 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 that's just my thing because sam had to go with chelsea somewhere i think it was to a school for parents meeting or something like that and me and mark sat here watching it so that's what we were doing. Then Sam came back, and then I said to Arwen, so we go, we go to the park, we were facing Pokemon Go, like you said we were going, she was like, Matt, I just got in, man, and bloody hell, it's cold, I don't want it. I was like, I told you you didn't want it, you wouldn't have wanted to do this. And she was like, uh, no, actually, I didn't realise I had to go to this thing until Chelsea come in. Bull, crap, rubbish. Anyway, it didn't matter. So we were sitting there, orange is the new black, orange is the new black, still watching it. It's all good. We're halfway through season, well, it's just gone past season three by a few episodes. Um, literally, Mark's falling asleep on the sofa, like sitting upwards. Uh, yeah. Now Mark, Mark's the one that does the cooking mainly. So I'm, every time I'm here, he does the cooking. Um, can, can you not see the Papa Doms?
What goes with Papa Doms? What else goes with Papa Doms? Naan bread. What do they have in common? A curry. Mark said to me, he was like, Do you want a chicken korma or a tandoori? I was like, No, a chicken tikka or a korma. And I was like, Half and half. And he was like, What? And I was like, Yeah, do half and half. And he was like, Okay. I was like, Okay. And he did, but he gave me more korma, so it went that. Although, literally, the rice, the rice is over there. I'm not going to turn the camera because somebody will probably slip. Oh, I malted it all together and I didn't I didn't dip any of the naan bread in it. <laughs> Even though I was supposed to. I didn't dip anything in. I didn't, oh man, I just ate the way it was. And then, me and my, me and my sister still sitting there. We're watching the program. Mark falls asleep. Then... Chelsea, not my niece, my uh, my nephew's, I'm guessing girlfriend. They keep on, they're either on and off. I don't know what they are there and I am clearly. They're either here or they're not. Anyway, so obviously she's staying the night because Cameron's gonna be staying the night, so that's okay. And then, and then Sam was like, I'm going upstairs now, and I was like, oh, okay, fine. So then two went upstairs. I'm sitting there. I'm literally. Watching Syndicate's vlog that is an hour, 57 minutes long. I've got the charger plugged in, watching the video. I'm only 20 minutes into it and I'm falling asleep. I haven't taken my tablet and I'm like, I'm just going to go into the, I'm just going to go in here now, get a drink, take my tablet, go to bed. I'll do the outro of this tomorrow. That's what I'm doing now. <laughs> So I took my tablet, literally, I was sitting there, but only, it's not even, I mean, is it not even one in the morning? I don't even have, a, there's not even a clock in here. I saw flashing lights, so that's for the thing. Oh, <laughs> I found a clock. <laughs> it's on the thing. Yeah, it's not even one o'clock. It's 20 to one in the morning. And I'm sitting there, for, literally sitting there. Mark accidentally woke up because he needed to go to the toilet. Perfectly fine. I'm sitting there watching a flipping 20 minutes into a 57 minute video. And I'm starting to fall asleep. I don't do this. I'm normally asleep at like half one. Uh, not half one. Flipping two o'clock, half two. Why am I so tired? The only thing I've done was I got up. I went to make plans. Unfortunately, it didn't happen because of an idiot. So then I was like, okay, I'll just do what I was going to do before I was going to do that. And, uh, yeah, met my sister in Woodage, met the dad. He got us a lovely cafe. Thank you very much. I'm not paying you back. No, I'm joking. I'll pay you back and kiss his dad. I will. Don't worry. Um, and then, yeah, just went around. Went to Tesco, come back here. I even said to Sam, I was like, okay, we can have a choice of two buses. One of the buses takes us just down the road from here. Two minute walk to the bus stop. The other one, you have to walk all the way along and then all the way down by the bridge. Maybe a five minute walk. Maybe, maybe, ten minute, not even ten minute walk. It's like a five minute walk. That one's like a minute walk, that one's a five. You know, extra four minutes, it counts. I swear we got a ghost in the house. Trying to video? You just heard that. That that must have been on the camera. Obviously I ain't seen the footage because I'm watching I'm doing this now. It just come on. The dryer come on. And now it's gone off. Random. And literally now I'm about to I was like Seeing as I'm going out there to take my tablets, I might as well do a two minute outro of saying where we left off. Um, and that was it, but it's turned into a 10 minute goddamn vlog itself. So I think this is a 16 or 17 minute flipping thing. Although, now I know that I've took my tablets, 
I'm going to wait till this uploads first because it'd be easier while I'm doing it while I'm watching the video. I could probably watch the rest of the video if I sit up and I don't fall asleep, which is a good thing because I get to watch the video, I get to upload this, I get to edit, sort it all out, schedule it, and go to bed. Well, these two cats here, well, I said, yeah, there's technically two cats that are inside right now because my sister has three cats. Now, obviously, you guys know I have eight. I have to deal with all of that eight. Although, I only have to deal with one because one is personally mine itself. But these three, these three cats are little shit. Casper, he's outside right now. He loves the outside. He loved the tree out the front. Buster, I mean, not Buster, Leo, the black cat, and Felix, the half black, half white cat, or half tabby, half white, every single morning around three, four o'clock ish, they get into a fight and you have to literally wake up to kick one of them outside or both of them. It's like, you're doing me head in. Luckily, they haven't fought nothing now. So, I'm going to end this clip, guys. Yeah, look, he made a mess. Look, there's the rice. That's Dean Curry. That technically he's going to have to rest that when he comes in to, from work because he's at work right now. Uh, apart from that, there's nothing to say. So it's been a good day. It's been a good day. Um, and then tomorrow, what should I say today because it's technically quarter to one in the morning I don't want to do anything I want to sit in and get this orange is new black watched well as many episodes as I can because Mark ain't got work for another couple of days Sam ain't got work till Friday so yeah and also I need a wee so I'm going to go guys have fun please like subscribe Dad, I love you because you you got me a lovely, lovely cat breakfast. And I'm just going to title this as, thank you, Dad, for the breakfast. Everyone knows it's true. It's gorgeous. It's munch. I'm going to go. Mm. Don't tell my sister. But I'm going to take another.